Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Big Moon Madness, where we do stuff on the moon. We got that one guy, 47, Buff Monkey, 100, and a Girl Warrior right here, who is apparently changing out of their costume. They, they didn't want to be seen for the entirety of fan generation, so now they're actually going into the thing. It's actually kind of funny, because they're like, oh, that's already uh, the baseline of fan generation. Uh, if I feel like it's going to go over 30 minutes... What the hell is this? Um. Oh god. <laughs> TF. Okay, you know what? Here. I'm gonna spawn this. Where is it? I had the object. Um. I had it saved. Oh, right here it is. For. Oh, wait. Is it? Oh, sorry. Thought I had it unpaused. Normally I unpause it as soon as I get in, but apparently I didn't this time. God dang it. Ask before copying. Okay. My beautiful My baby! I thought I was gonna say get fucked. Look at the little thing. Merry Christmas. Where's that car? There was a car here. Um... Why is it hovering? I'll ask again. Why is it hovering? Freaking Starbucks during the Christmas time. What is this? Hold on. I'm gonna order some uh, explosive jalapenos to go, please. And we're gonna make sure none of this ever happens again. Give me one second here. And... Okay. First one to explode wins. Okay, you didn't explode. She, she's back. What? Oh, no. Put her away! Okay. The, the, one's Bob and one's Sharon. Uh, they don't have any featuring traits, but they're both attracted to each other, as you can tell right here. Um, they're both very volatile, meaning they'll explode at any moment, so you have to be careful when handling them. Um... Can, can I help you? I'm trying to explain the nature of my friends here. Don't you dare! No! 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 Oh my god. Okay, apparently they had a kid. And his name is Matthew. So Bob and Sharon had a kid. W w er, and uh, one day the kid decided to go off on his own. And uh, basically rolled towards his dad. His dad basically tried to divorce his mom. But he kept gravitating towards his dad. Because he wouldn't leave his dad the hell alone. Uh, Matthew slowly ran downhill, and Sharon was followed because she didn't like the, the divorce happening. So Sharon, trying to bring the family back together, finally came back after Bob's a cheating bitch. But I kicked him out of the way because I said, you can do better than Bob, and blew up the entire restaurant. There we go. Now, Bob, Bob and Matt are still alive to these days. Uh, but then suddenly I body slammed both of them and they were both dead. The end. Ooh, shooting range. Okay, let's go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. Uh, die. Get in. Help me shoot. <laughs> okay, get him. I'm not really good at aiming at video games. Uh. Okay, we need help. Back up. Someone said back up. Bob and Sharon did this. Oh, no, no, no. They almost got us. Is that supposed to be our health down there, or is that time? Uh, okay, yeah, abandon me in my time of need. Oh my god, is this Chrono Trigger music? I guarantee that the, the time's almost up. Uh... Oh, we lost. Festival of Stars. Nice, I like it, I like it. Very good. Very good. I like the song. You see that? Uh, excuse me. Where to? Ah, oh, nice, cool.
Nice. That that's uh, pretty cool. Sit. Okay. Running man, please. That's one thing I always like uh, in Little Big Planet is like people doing musical compositions, even um, even if it's not like technically. In it, but I love music. But um, yeah, Little Big Planet, while it not be like major game design, it does give you an idea of like how to go about doing game design. Like a little bit, because it gives you a little background like, okay, what do I need to put in this level? Do I want to put a story? What kind of music do I want to put in it? What kind of theme is for the music? A am I making like a shooting game? Am I making a platformer? Am I making a role-playing game? Is there going to have to be stats in that? You basically have to think that kind of thing. Meanwhile, Starbucks is on fire like it should be. You know, long ago in a di uh, galaxy uh, very far away that I wish was our galaxy, Starbucks was constantly on fire. Mainly because of Bob and Sharon were basically, like, arguing so much that they burned down Starbucks, the place that they met. Also, there's, like, a butane lighter, like, going off right over here. Or butane tank. Da 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 Okay, yeah, I'm getting away from Starbucks and this fresh hell. What is this? Uh, is this a slap arena thing that we did last time? The Starbucks needs some watermelons. Um, I'd say something, but I'd probably get shot. I don't want to shit. Where are we, Yoshi? Go, go. There, I said it. You happy? I said it. I said it, we're Yoshi. You want to fight about it? What are we, like conductors now? Um, what are you doing, Buff Monkey? Give me one of these guns. I just want one! Uh, um, they shoot Pokeballs. Get caught! Oh god, no, 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 no. Put the gun down! Put the gun down! Put it down! I'm telling you, put the gun down. I told you. Put the gun down. I warned you. It's not. One guy, I told you to put the gun down. Both of you, put the gun down. Put the gun down! Kid, put the gun down. I'm telling you again. Okay, uh, he still doesn't surrender after all this time. Yeah, that's what you get. Yeah. See, I win. Yeah, I win. Doesn't matter if you send me flying, I still win. Because I didn't die. What's this? What's this do? Um, I don't even want to know. I, I I don't want any part of this. I, I didn't see nothing. I didn't just see an angry, uh, dark-skinned sack boy pop out and basically threaten... Okay, no, please. No! 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 And before, like, someone goes like, That's racist! You say all black people explode? Okay, well, Starbucks has got its last deserved item. Meanwhile, this light is still humping the fire. Never mind. It's all gone. It all returns to nothing. Uh, I would spawn map, but I don't want to, like, kill everybody. What is this? There we go. Bakuja steam. There we go. I wish I could have gotten to like music sequencers or whatever. Because I, I would have actually enjoyed, but I have no sense of rhythm, so. Uh, I need to use uh, WC. You guys, gonna take a double. Okay, I'll be right back. What does WC stand for, anyways? This is totally me when I, I freaking 
play Tricky Towers with Garma. Every time I play that game, I'd have to go take a poop. Okay, it doesn't say anything when you come out, so. There we go. Ah, oh, long me long time. Oh my god. Uh, why can this thing, like, go through everything? It's literally destroying everything. It's taking away our jobs! Okay. No. No, no, no. No, no. Send a flying. Also, I need, I need a new costume. I need a new identity. I need to go undercover. I, I can't be Sada anymore. If I'm Sada, they'll know who I am. So I will go become the albino octopus. That's my new alias. I'm I'm like an anti-hero. I don't really fight for any side. I just fight what I think is right. And sometimes that conflicts with the general consensus. Roadrunner, please. I'm trying to tell my tragic backstory here. Uh, at least the head will always be there. Head, do you know what's going on? Do you want to know what's going on? Well, you know what? Too bad. You're going to find out what's going on anyways. Give me one second. What have I pulled out in a while? I, don't know, I still don't know why I have that box. Um, oh, America Beam. That's it. Here it comes the America Beam. America! No. I just saw clouds. Yeah, anyone can get to like burn out their eyes today? Uh, cause the eyes sure as hell didn't want to. They said there's like basically cheap ways of looking at it. To me, as long as you don't do look directly into the sun, you're fine. Oh well. I don't really care to be quite honest. It's, it, like even if I see it, it's like oh, the, like it's gonna be like one of those things where it's like oh, that's kind of cool, and then like I go about my day. Unless I was recording like something on it. Okay, well I lost the America Bean. Unless I was recording something on it, then I would care and like doing a documentary like all right, this is how a solar eclipse happens, yada yada, and and basically we haven't had a solar eclipse since this time and. Uh, basically, it's gonna happen this again, so you, uh, if you miss it out, here's some pictures and videos. And basically go into, like, detail stuff. But since I don't do any of that stuff, and I'm just a dumb commentator on the internet, um, I, pr I pretty much just spend most of my time cleaning and, uh, trying to salvage both my channels on YouTube. Well, One's my channel, one's a co-op channel that me and Skelly share. I changed it to Skeleton Sphinx, but I'm going to change it back to Damn Dynamic, Damn Dynamic Duo because he never used it for his own thing and ended up making his own channel. I said, it's like, hey, use this. Could have watched the stream, but I was sleeping. But, uh, excuse me. But, what was it? Um, ooh, Mr. Crocomire, how are you doing? Let me uh, delve into your delicious teeth. Okay, th that's rude. I just want it in your mouth. Yeah, now you can't do anything. Now take me to your leader. Okay. Um. Crocoman. Crocman, no! He was like uh, my brother. Uh. Oh yeah, thanks for slapping me. What way to like kick me in the balls when my brother died. Jesus. But yeah, going back to what I was talking about, um the the whole like YouTube channel thing with uh also the co op channel, it's it I doubt that channel's blacklisted. It's probably just like the algorithm's really, really screwed up right now like it's targeting channels that doesn't need to be if youtube's trying to go for a family friendly site after like what happened with the whole pewdiepie fiasco 
you're not going to get that. All you're going to do is drive away, like, all your cop, drive all the way your, your uh, people that make you money into the arms of your competition. Who are the competition YouTube? Vimeo, Dailymotion, um, what else is there? I know there was, like, another one. Anyways, that or some of them just make something else. Some of them will get so fed up, meet up with a bunch of programmers, and start making something else. You don't think that will happen in this, in this day and age? You're freaking out of your mind. Like, like, YouTube, get your stuff together. Like, I really like creating content on YouTube and freely expressing myself and doing whatever I want to do. That's why I've stuck with it for so long. But, like, if I ever find, like, an outlet where, like, like streaming or, like, some other thing that keeps me occupied 100% of my time, I'm not going to care about making videos anymore. I won't care about, like, that extra little um, pocket money that I get for to help, like, get games for the channel or invest in the channel. It, it's just not going to, like, like, I don't understand. It's just kind of dumb. And it annoys me. I, I feel like if I talked about this in an update video, no one would take me seriously. So that's why I'm talking about it up here. While I'm running on Roadrunner. That's my favorite thing to do. Talk about issues with YouTube. Wrong thing. Yeah, Roadrunner. Yeah. Roadrunner runs over competition. Uh, who's running? Stop it. Stop your crying. I'll teach you a lesson, young man. Who puts a gun next to their freaking TV? <laughs> I'm sorry. I have... No! He has to be put down. He has to be put down. Snake has to be put down for the greater good. He's a terrorist. There we go. And before this no longer becomes viewer friendly. Because of what I said. All for the sake of jokes. Iron Man. Hi, Iron Man. Iron Man, please stop grabbing me. Iron Man, I don't need help. Iron Man, that, that's... Iron Man, you're a sexual... Iron Man stole my gun! Iron Man stole my gun! <coughs> Iron Man stole my gun. Where's the cops when you need them? Can uh, someone arrest Iron Man? Like, even if, if someone's being a villain and, like, they legally paid for that gun, then they're just kind of, like, waving around and Iron Man comes and steals it. Is that technically, like, Iron Man, like, theft? Like, if they haven't shot anybody or is, like, Iron Man... Or if... I, I don't know. At one side would argue it's, like, well, he hasn't shot anybody, so uh, unless he thought about shooting somebody, then it's not pre uh, premeditated murder. On the other hand, like, well, he has a gun out and open. He might be willing to shoot somebody if... He's that dumb. I don't know. I don't really want to think about it. I don't want to be part of the discussion, but I brought it up. Because it's part of the discussion now. I'm... Yes. Accidentally mashed my keyboard. Okay, let's... Let's play video games. What? Um... What? I can't see. Can you give me another angle? How do I... I want another angle! Well, since I can't get another angle out of that... Oh, so you stole sex top hat. That's that. <clears throat> Okay, I hear a kaiju. The only way to battle a kaiju is with another kaiju. Also, why is ears in my eye sockets? I'm not sure I enjoy this. I guarantee he's going to steal my kaiju right off the bat. 
Okay, well, we're already off to a bad start. I wanted this one instead. There we go. Don't worry, brothers. I will destroy everything. The Super Kamimaha! Actually, I've been watching, like, a little bit of Dragon Ball Super lately, like... And by a little bit, I mean I've been putting it on the background. Yeah, I know I obliterated the thing. You can't stop this. No one can stop this thing. Like, I'm just a floating head at this point. If anyone wanted to stop this... Also, that reminds me, I want to check something. I don't want front view. Um... Okay. Well, anyways, I'm gonna end this episode of Mega Moon Madness. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, everybody, I'll see you then. Later.